shell to drop on this company? We'll find out about that next week. official Mr. Brian Hebner. And now, from Universal Studios Orlando, it's time for your main event of the evening. Introducing first, standing in the corner to my left, he weighed in this morning at 238 pounds and comes to us from Leapers Fork, Tennessee. He is one half of Standing in the corner to my right, he weighed in this morning at 222 pounds and comes to us from Pittsburgh, Pennsylvania. He is the reigning heavyweight champion of the world and professional wrestling's only Olympic gold medalist, Kurt Angle. have to love the fighting spirit, the courage of James Storm to issue the challenge to Kurt Angle and at the same time, how about Kurt Angle? Even with the big World Heavyweight Championship match coming up at Bound for Glory against Storm's partner, Bobby Roode. Angle, he's not going to back away from the challenge, is he, Taz? Oh, no, it's impossible for Kurt to back away from the challenge. Are you kidding me? But I respect James Storm. Oh, oh, wow. Double leg, double leg. Wow. Well, wants to play that game. It always comes down when you have a match with Kurt Angle to that decision whether you want to out wrestle Kurt or not. Not many no, have been no. successful at that through the years. I've tried uh, to out wrestle Kurt. It, 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 it didn't work many times for me, so I can't speak for sure. <laughs> Haymakers right here by James Storm, and that's that's James Storm's M.O. He's just a fighting ass kicking country boy, you know what I mean? That's his deal. And what better way 
Ray to control Kurt Angle to grab that side headlock, keep Angle down in the mat. And right now, Storm in control. Yeah, but I, again, I don't know if it's just an opinion as an ex wrestler. I don't know if Storm should go to just a side headlock, take him down, and try to keep Kurt there. I think he might have more success with punching and strikes and kicks and whatnot. But he's got a pretty tight side headlock on there. We know Angle always thinking several moves ahead. Shoulder block takedown by Storm and right back to the neutralizing headlock. And also, if you notice, a little subtle things like the arm is trapped. Kurt Angle's arm is trapped when Storm did that headlock takeover. So it prevents Kurt from utilizing that other arm to clash and get out of the hole. A little small detail that's, that's important. And speaking of the small details and the nuances, how about the way that Angle counters, stepping on the back of the leg of Storm, going to the hammerlock, then switching around, ending with that big European uppercut. He broke down the joint of the knee of Storm, and whoa, whoa, wait! No! Oh. head smashed right into the base of that ramp out there. Look at this, look at this back body drop. Storm immediately out to the arena floor to follow up the edge that he's got. There goes Kurt right in the barricade. Oh. Angle able to stop Storm's attempt to throw him into the ring steps, then turns it around and tosses the cowboy head first and face first right into the steel. That was a lot of impact into those, into those steel steps. A lot of impact there. going to go out to the floor and you would think that really Storm would like to have a fight out on the floor but Kurt Angle oh! takes him with a belly to belly suplex what a thud when Storm landed on the entrance ramp driver's seat. Big explosive move with the suplex on the ramp. And now Angle will storm in. And now it's Kurt Angle's time to dissect his opponent. Look at a knee right there, Mike. You know, Angle's right knee is uh, right in the middle of the back of Storm. That's what makes that chin lock so effective. Yeah, and you know, Storm realized that being a veteran. He got to a vertical base real quick. And right, one place knee in the gut. Off his vertical base. Took him down, doubled him over. Quick cover here by Kurt for two. One thing we know about Kurt Angle, no wasted movement or motion. Now, I know he's got that butterfly grip as he has that reverse gut wrench, that bear hug, a reverse bear hug on uh, James Storm. And he's got, Kurt has his whole chest and body weight on Storm, squeezing the solar plexus area of Storm. How about the grip of Kurt Angle? Yeah, well, he did, he did an over and under grip. He's off it now. That's a real tight, strong grip. A lot of freestyle wrestling moves. Swinging this clothesline by Angle. Both men go for the cross body. And both Angle and Storm connect. Yeah, pull down. I, 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 Mike, I, on a shot earlier on a camera angle, I think uh, it looked like Kurt Angle's left elbow might have might be bleeding, might have a gash or a cut in it or something. He's a little stain of blood there. I know it's some kind of a, I think he might have split his left elbow or shoulder or something over the top rope with that backdrop. It was a hell of a landing. Angle right back at it. Storm catches him. Series of right. Second one went right to the top of the head. Ooh. Inverted atomic drop. Here he comes off the ropes. Big time clothesline. Off the back elbow, another clothesline for Storm. Storm. Now, the champ's on the defensive. You're not kidding. I mean, James Storm is on, <laughs> on fire, man. But how quickly can Angle turn it around? Oh, and he gets stabbed in the back. Here's the pin. Here's the cover. Oh, man. That would have been a huge upset right there. confidence level rising here in James Storm the longer this match goes with each passing minute. Oh, it's definitely building that, that confidence, but the key I'm wondering is, oh, wait a minute, wait a minute. Ooh. Well, James Storm's been doing a, a ton of, oh, hold on a second. Belly to belly, the release suplex and the pin for two. Oh, 
don't look for a spade a spade to me. James Storm, he's a tag team wrestler. There's a different type of conditioning when you used to tag team when you're supposed to be in a singles. World champion. Yeah, like when it comes Kurt. to conditioning and Kurt Angle, the words are synonymous. He's gonna go angle slam. Instead, Storm floats over. Oh, look at that drop down right wow. there. That ankle lock. Beautiful. Storm quickly going to try to get the, the break, getting the ropes. And Kurt able to turn it around. Uh, Maybe the free leg he can use to kick off, but Angle with that great grip strength maintains the lock. Yeah, it's not just the grip strength. Kurt sinks his hips into the knee of James Storm. He puts his hips in to keep his body weight on as Storm is kicking. Angle has got that ankle lock in perfect ring positioning. Dead center in the middle, and his score going to tap. He's got his hand in the air. He's going to tap out here. Applied, able to roll through his score. Can he get the pin? Two. Oh, oh, oh look at that Kurt Angle, a tad overzealous. Sidestep, quick roll up by Storm. Oh, oh. near fall after near fall. James Storm, my man is begging for this win. He's close several times. Storm to the power game. Drives Angle down with the slam. It looks like he's positioning himself in the corner for the last call super kick. Waiting for Angle to get back up to his feet. Kurt able to block it and immediately turns it around into his advantage. First German suplex and still has control. Yeah, with Kurt Angle. Once he lowers his level and pops back into a back off, you have no choice but to go flying, man, with those German suplexes. We've seen Kurt do multiple German suplexes in a row. That's a third one. Will that be enough? After the third suplex, hook of the leg. Well, I think that uh, James Storm, he's definitely showing a load of intestinal fortitude here. There is no quit in James Storm. And I think he's earning the respect of the Olympic gold medalist and the world heavyweight champion, that, Kurt Angle. That's exactly what Storm said he was going to do, and I think you're right. Top row moves off. But Storm able to roll out of the way and avoid the contact from Angle from the top. Both these men are spent out here. They are leaving it all in the ring. This is a hell of a match here. Both men really struggling. Just the kind of competitive match that you would expect for our Impact Wrestling main event. Kurt Angle down. James Storm headed to the top, going to go high risk, but Kurt, the quick recovery. Heads up to meet Storm. Well, not that's only a punching, but yeah, biting the head of Angle. Kurt looked like he was going for a belly to belly overhead suplex off those ropes. Look at Storm. going to regroup from the top and caught him off the top. You got a feel for Storm right now. Look at his eyes. He's like, you gotta have him beat the way after do. Storm again, measuring, waiting for Angle to get back up to the vertical base. As both men reach their feet, the exchange. Yeah, well, well, punch for punch. Both athletes still have some snap in those punches, too. To the shoulder, gonna go eye of the Storm here. Oh, he's got Kurt. Kurt's in grave danger here. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Got a mortal backup in the form of Gunner, who gets dropped off the apron. Instead, oh, the Lord slides in from behind, hits the angle slam, covers, and gets it. Oh, just two! You believe it? No. <laughs> I thought Storm was done. The point finished. Come on. Storm. I think Kurt's a little feels disrespected. Oh, oh. That time, the super kick, the last call kick connected, but on the referee, Brian Hebner. That counter with that all trick. Oh, yeah. Storm. And then he caught Angle. Here he is, he's got the pin after the last call. Fans of the impact So counting. Senior official Earl Hebner coming down to the ring to make the count. 
Earl slides in. Here's two. Oh, Gunner pulls him back out to the floor. And that's what a mortal is. They're a family, and Kurt Angle is a proud member of as is Gunner. World Heavyweight oh Championship belt of Angle. Who brought it to play? And Gunner took the championship belt and just drove it right into the head of Storm. All hell has broken loose in the impact zone. His opponent at Bound for Glory, Kurt Angle, in the midst of this competitive match against his longtime tag partner, Jim Storm. Rude looks at the championship belt that he hopes to win at Bound for Glory. Kurt Angle to do it, baby. Going through Kurt Angle, that's never an easy task.